All right, we are going to do Solo Champions League 704. This is game one, Leadership Groot. Got 40 cards, Contingency Plan, Calculate the Odds, Creative Solution. Throw those into the deck. Shuffle that up, and first turn. Well, draw. Um, so... Calculate the odds is one that we actually want to keep because we can kind of turn it into two possible future cards instead of just one. Not, I mean, not two old cards, but two cards we get to choose from. So we should save that. Um, Mockingbird, if we end up playing her, uh, doesn't help us do a lot against the threat, so we would really need to use the Library Labyrinth, but that's that's fine. Um, so I might get rid of that, that, that. The only group card I'm finding I'm using is the uh, Root Stomp, because that thing actually snags the Power Stone, so that, that thing's kind of valuable. All right. Um, Adam Warlock is just kind of obscenely powerful in this, um, but with Power and All of Us, I potentially want to use that with with Mockingbird. So I might actually cycle to see if I can get some more cards in here, right? Um, Adam Warlock also requires a discard. So... Ugh. Okay, yeah. Well, let's calculate the odds and see what we get, we get here. Um... Well, we're definitely not going to make the call with this hand. So what do we have here? Uh, at this point, right, Rocket is worth a couple of extra thwart net. Mockingbird, of course, avoids an attack altogether. Marie Hill. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. If I use Marie Hill, that's eight with draw, so she's three. That leaves five. So I could Maria Hill and Adam Warlock, but then I would not have a card to discard. Is that right? So if I go Maria Hill, it gets me a card. Oh, did I count that wrong? No, that's right. Okay, so if I did Maria Hill, I would still have Fruition, Rocket, draw a card. I could play Adam Warlock, but not actually use him. Um, Maria Hill could take that down to five. Group could thwart, take that down to four. And also we don't know what Maria Hill might give. I could also do something similar, but get Mockingbird and still play Fruition. So we'll bring out Maria Hill. Hmm. For Rocket and Fruition. Okay. And then is this the threat one? It is. So I could play Welcome Aboard with the Adam Warlock and Mockingbird. So Marie Hill does one, two. Adam Warlock does one and then ditches this. For one, two, three. Right, so it started at seven. One, two, three, six. We should be at one.
and then I've got a choice here. Um, you know, I can try to rush it a little bit and break flip, get two encounter cards, have two blockers. Oh, sorry, I forgot to grab my counters when I was grouped. Um, and get that thing over to Right, if when, it, when it flips over, it's four away from its threshold, so I can make it nine away from its threshold. It would be eight away from its threshold. So I would definitely lose if I had a double advance. Seven. Right, I can also get an insight, so that would be seven, and then he schemes for two, three, four, five, and two. So an insight and an advance would also make me lose, probably. And that's a much more realistic thing. So let's let's not advance him. Oh, sorry, I meant to do that. So we're going to not advance. Oh, and I attack for two. Um, right, sweet. A couple of Gamora strikes, that will be awesome. So a boost, we will block with Maria Hill. He gets tough. And then, thank you, Maria Hill. And we got advance. One, two, so it was one, two, three, four, five, six. All right. So turn two. Um, it's the extra attack one. So I think we sneak Gamora out with welcome aboard and this, and then see what comes out of this. We're gonna use, let's use Gamora to actually attack to get rid of this, tough. So she starts at three and is down at two. Then we go searching for an event card here. Nick Fury is not an event card. Make the call is. All right. So what can we afford with, with three? We could make the call Maria Hill. Use get ready and then kind of hope we have good synergy with Adam Warlock. I like that. So make the call Maria Hill. Oops. That gets us a card. Sweet, it's a fist. Okay, so one, two. I never actually <laughs> flipped Gruner. Maybe he started and I flipped him and it was not the way I meant to flip him. Um, So I think I'm going to push through this. So I'm going to go one, use the library to grab this. That goes. And just to go through these real quick, um, get the Milano. And this is at 11. Okay. 
Oh, we can actually root stomp and steal. Well, that's interesting. Um, oh, do I actually want to flip that? Let me, hold on, let me take that back. Because if I flip it, I actually want to make it so I have the five. But I'm not going to have the extra encounter card. Oh, no, I do have an extra encounter card. So that's going to be four. Ooh, do I actually even want to make, wait one more turn? Seems so bad. I'm not in any better position than I was last time other than I have way more blockers. So I, I thwart without a warlock. All right, right, right. So I had to think about this for a while. Um, I'm not going to do this, so I'm going to stay at 11. I'm actually going to stay on the previous scheme, even though I threw it out. Um, we'll just say I'm on the previous scheme. It has a, um, what is the threshold of 11? Um, I'm going to use Adam Warlock, and then I don't have this. Roll d6. It's four. Okay, so I get rid of root stomp. So Adam Warlock takes us down to one. I can get ready with Gamora. One, two, go grab another event. Interesting. Just back to where I was last turn. Stupid. Okay, well, I'm going to ditch my get ready. And I'm just going to call that one good, actually. Because um, I want a card to be able to use without a Morlock. And I've decided I'm going to do my best to avoid an auto loss. So let's avoid that. Maria Hill again. Right. Once we get that second, once I know where that second advance is, I could change my tune here. So wilt, so that's going to be flip and flip, flip and tap, and it is now turn three. I'm going to grab two counters and flip. So we could root stomp and snag the power stone. Um, use the rest of the stuff to grab Ant-Man and actually save this. Wait, so I can root stomp, 
Grab the power stone. Bring Ant-Man out with two. One, two. Ant-Man can finish that scheme off. Now we're actually advancing to number two. Adam Warlock with this. We'll do it for, for four. Um, we'll leave Gamora as a blocker for now. And then we'll use the Labyrinth to get this down to two. And there's not two advances in here, so I can just do that. Oh, I guess I should have remembered that last turn. I wasn't really in danger because there was two advances. Damn it. Okay, well, done. And for reference, is Lockjaw in here? No. Okay. That was definitely my second Adam Warlock. Activation. There's no reason to use Gamora. Okay. Oh, sorry, I didn't even say who I was blocking with. It would have been, I guess, Ant Man. Right, Gamora. Get me another event card if I use her. No, I, it doesn't really matter. Yeah, man, I say. Okay, sorry about that. Um, and then this is the actual that two. The actual encounter card. Uh, you are stunned. You get attacked. You are stunned. And now Gamora will block this one. And the other encounter card, insight one, you're confused. Great. Got the power stone, can't do anything with it. Got creative solution though. So turn four. We're definitely going to bring out, we can bring out Spidey, get ready him, and even have an extra card for something. So I can get rid of confused or stunned, so threat or damage, so I could get my damage that way, or my threat. So the first thing I'm going to do is library to get rid of this one. And now I bring these in, even though it's not going to matter. And put uh, put excel. Come on, acceleration token. Put an acceleration token on here, and we flip it, and it comes in at eight. Tap the Milano, it's at five. Creative solution. Right, Compute is not the one, right? So that gets rid of three. Um, actually, let's keep the Milano uh, tapped to untapped just so if there's some some way that I can maneuver my way into higher points, I can do that. We are Groot, so we'll bring in Spidey for... Oh, right, I definitely don't want to use them up there. Okay, there we go. Bring in Spidey.
and he has three health. I guess I attack with Groot. That flips collector, takes down to two, use Milano. What am I doing? And that's zero. Okay, so it's pretty janky to watch, I think, but that was turn four. I have 14 health and clean board. 